I am Cybex author William Panic. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create Active Directory objects. The objects that we're going to create are user accounts. Now, to do this, we have to get into Active Directory users and computers. And the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to hit the Windows key on my keyboard, and then I'm going to click on Administrative Tools. Once the Administrative Tools comes up, I'm going to click on Active Directory users and computers. Once the Active Directory Users and Computers MMC appears, I'm going to click on the Users OU, and then I'm going to right click and I'm going to say New User. Now, you don't have to create this user in the Users OU. You can actually create the user in one of the other organizational units that you've already created, like Africa, Asia. These were all created in previous videos. The name that we're going to use here is we're going to use the same as the exercise in 4.5, Maria D. President. And then the user logon name is going to be MD President, and it's going to be MD President at Cybex.com. So I'm going to click Next. Now, here's where you put in a password. So I'm going to use the same one as the exercise, P at SSW0RD, capital P, P at SSW0RD. And you have the ability here to say user must change password at next logon. You can say user cannot change password, password never expires, or account is disabled. So we're just going to leave it as user must change password at next login. So I'm going to click on next. I'll hit the finish button. Maria President has actually now been created. I'll expand this a little bit. So now you can see their account. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to create a second user account following the exercise. And I'm going to say new user and this one's going to be John Adams. So I created John Adams and it's going to be JQ Adams at Cybex.com and I'll click on next and again we're going to use the same password capital P at SSW0RD capital P at SSW0RD I'll say next and I'll say finish. And it's as simple as that to create users in Active Directory. In this video, I showed you how to create Active Directory objects in Active Directory users and computers.